children welcome back to our digital class in the previous lesson we learnt about the snakes in india and i hope you enjoyed a lot by reading the text given in the textbook and it's a time to learn another interesting activity that is poster making are you ready children let us go through the objectives of the lesson you will be able to understand features of poster making layout of poster making tips to prepare a poster uses of a poster designing a poster children have you ever prepared a poster if not let us give a try so making poster is a very interesting activity let us do it together are you ready what is a poster a poster is a card or placard carrying some announcements advertisement etc a good poster at once catches the attention of the passers by it can be used to promote a, a product event sentiment such as a patriotism or addiction contains a striking designs and artwork points to take care use captions use slogans logos emblem symbols pictures diagrams sketches messages messages must be short messages telegraphic language content information details statistics figures children you have enjoyed the session let us watch the interaction session by a teacher Good afternoon, children. Good afternoon, sir. So by this time, if you have read the lesson snakes in India, am I right? Yes. So you know how the snakes are useful to us, am I right? Yes. Snakes are useful to us. Yes. How? Agriculture. And this is our agriculture product. Now it's the time that we are going to prepare it. A poster. Have you ever seen this kind of material anywhere? Yes. Where did you find this type of material generally? Gram panchayat. Yeah. Offices. Offices, some offices also. Even in newspapers also you find. Am I right? Advertisements and the posters that it will be. What do the posters consist of? Poster consist of some information. Anything else? Apart from information, do you find anything? What do you find in this? Colorful text. Okay. Colorful images also there. Colorful images. Any drawings? Any drawings are there? Do you find any drawings? Designs also there. Some designs also there. Anything else at the top and at the bottom of this poster? Do you find anything? Who issued this poster? It is also given. What is this? Title of the poster. So generally, these are the characteristics and the features of the poster. What do the post uh, poster consisting of? Title, issue and name. And some images, some drawings, colorful pictures, and some text also there. How is the text in this poster? Very small, not a little bit paragraphs. Huh? They are very catchy, attractive. The text that we use in the poster must be very catchy and attractive. We should not use the lengthy sentences in it. Am I right? Yes. Okay, nice. Now let us sit in groups so that. You can observe the posters that I am going to supply to you. Yes. Then you make a list of the things. What do you find in that post? Okay. Yes. Observe the poster clearly and make a list of all these things. Whether the title is there, issuer name is there, how uh, images are there. Like that, you have to make a list. After watching the video. I hope you have understood the important features and the characteristics of the poster. Let us check your understanding now. 
features of the poster attractive appropriate pictures brevity slogans and quotations layout colorful drawings details of a poster are advertisement it must contain heading that is title caption venue date time program details pictures drawings issuer details children it's time to watch important video on model posters while watching the video let us observe what are the features that we discussed in the previous slides it's a time to watch the teacher's input and let us observe the poster supply to you with proper care observe the posters given to you and think of these aspects whether the poster that has given to you consisting of these qualities the first one is the attractiveness do you find that the poster is an attractive one then put the trick mark then appear appropriate pictures do you find any pictures in your poster then put it a right mark that there are pictures in my poster like that and slogans and quotations so the issue of the, the purpose of the issue in the posters is to uh, attract the people so for that reason they generally use the slogans and the quotations so if you find any quotations and the slogans in the poster just put a trick mark there and like that layout so every poster consisting of some layouts borders some designs drawings and all other things if you find those things in your poster you also make a list of those things okay and next the drawings and you should a colorful like that so another aspect is that generally every poster consisting of an a heading if you find the heading in your poster you make a list of that what is the heading that is mentioned in it okay this may be a possibility that all the posters may not consisting of the headings also you leave it there next one is the venue so if we, the poster that is related to a particular event then there must be a event for that and the venue date time and the program details and issuer details also
So these are the, the suggested characteristics of the features of the poster. So observe carefully the poster that is supplied to you and make a list of the things. Children, you might have observed the posters given to you. Now it is a time to watch the presentations of some of your friends. Our poster title is Snake Safety and Colorful, Small Small Sentence, Picture as Snake, Precautions. Children, how is the presentation of your friends? I hope you enjoyed it. Now it is a time to do the same thing with the help of your teacher. It is a time to prepare the poster and while preparing the poster, let us focus on the objectives of the preparing the posters and some useful tips in making a poster. Objectives of preparing a poster, awareness, knowledge, linking, preference, purchase, conviction, beliefs. Remember, attention grabbing, brief, concrete information, make it neat and clean, do not write too much information, draw the relevant pictures, diagrams, symbols, cartoons and sketches. Essential details, example, date, time, venue. Use of horizontal letters, use dark letters on light backgrounds, use light letter on dark backgrounds. Nice color combinations, letter style, easy to read, careful about spelling. While preparing the poster, remember these things. Use simple words, simple language, simple colors, simple designs. Children, observe the following posters while watching. Observe carefully the futures of the poster making. So, this is the poster made on poster making tips. It consists of attractiveness, appropriate pictures, brevity, slogans, quotations, layout, colorful drawings. Details of poster or advertisement, heading, title, caption, etc., venue, date, time, pictures, diagrams, program details, issuer details. Children now sit in groups and select the topic of your own interest. Group activity. Do the following tasks. Group 1, snakes in India. Group 2, first aid, do's and don'ts. Group 3, precautions to avoid snake bites. Group 4, myths and facts. Input questions for the group 1. Snakes in India. What are the different snakes find in India? Give examples, their habitat, food they eat, features, input questions for group 2 that is first aid, do's and don'ts, recollect the incidents of snake bites, recollect the video you have watched in the previous digital class, do's, don'ts, to whom we should call or contact, arrangements to be made, plan a layout first heading and issuer details. Watch this video. Many of you are familiar with this scene in your village. A group of children playing in an open area. Watch this boy who is chasing the ball. He enters the nearby bushy area. He spots a snake. In no time it crawls out of its hideout. The scared boy 
tries to shoo away the snake by throwing a stone. The snake does not crawl away. Instead, it turns towards the boy and bites him on the foot. The boy screams for help. His friends run to his side to help. They see two red spots on the foot. They carry the boy out of the bush. There is a commotion. All the children give different opinions about first aid. Here comes the importance of knowing the first aid in case of a snake bite. Welcome to Spoken Tutorial on First Aid on Snake Bites. In this tutorial, we will see how important is first aid and how to give the correct first aid in case of a snake bite. Before moving on to the first aid instructions, we will review what the group of boys did to save their friend. They made the boy lie down and then they sought the help of elders to shift him to the hospital. Then they tied a cloth above the wound. Was it the right first aid? Yes, in a way it is correct. In this case, the hospital was not far away. So the boy got the medical aid in time. The correct way to give first aid in case of a snake bite is Make the person lie down on a flat surface. Roll a cloth on the affected area. The primary purpose of this first aid is to stop the poison from circulating throughout the body. And how should we roll the cloth around the wound? Start rolling from the upper portion of the leg and move downwards. Shift the person quickly to the nearest hospital for further treatment. In this way, first aid given in time prevents many damages. Remember, wrong first aid can make one's condition worse. Do's in case of a snake bite. First, lay the victim down. When you roll the clot, apply some pressure. And the don'ts in case of a snake bite. Do not cut the skin or the flesh around the bite. Do not put eyes on or around the bite. Do not shock the person with electricity. Do not try to suck the blood or the venom out of the bite. And do not tie the cloth too tight. This could lead to gangrene. Input questions for the group 3. Precautions to avoid snake bite. Think of different instances where the snake bite occurs, why and how. Think of different reasons for not saving them, why. Think of different places where the snake intrude and why. List the different measures to avoid such incidents. Watch this video. You know to keep snakes at bay, you will need boots, pants, a tent with a working zipper, and caution. Optional, a walking stick. Step 1. Make noise while you're walking in the woods. Step heavily to make the ground vibrate and scare snakes away. Step 2. Wear long pants and tall boots when you're hiking or camping. They will protect your feet and legs from snakes as well as insects. Step 3. Stay on the trail when hiking. Don't wander off into the brush or tall grass where snakes may lie hidden. If you can't avoid tall grasses or brush, use a walking stick as a feeler for the ground in front of you. Step 4. Put your tent in a clearing away from potential nesting sites, including tall grass, logs, boulders, and brush. Keep your tent zipped tight at all times. Step 5. Don't reach into dark places where snakes might be sleeping or hiding, including rock crevices and hollow logs. Be careful when moving rocks or gathering firewood. Remember that not all snakes stay on the ground. Some slither up trees and hang from low branches. Step 6. Don't touch a snake if you come across one, dead or alive. If it doesn't slither away, go around it. Some dead snakes still have a bite reflex, so don't mess around. Step 7. Don't panic if you are bitten. Wash the wound and get to a doctor immediately if you suspect the snake might be poisonous. Did you know? The Gaboon Viper, an African snake, has fangs that grow up to 2 inches, longer than any other snake. Input questions for the group 4, myths and facts. Collect myths from different sources. Find out whether it is true or false. Layout, heading, title, organization of content. Children, 
I hope you liked the presentations of some of your friends. Now it is a time to do the same thing, take the help of your teacher and present the posters prepared by you. Let us observe the posters prepared by some of your friends. Precautions of snakes, precaution to be taken, maintain cleanliness, cut the grass, don't put hands in hole, read dogs, don't play sounds, music with attract snakes, close upper part of tank, use touch light in night, don't throw the dust in our surroundings, close the holes, don't occupy the forest because the forest are snakes home. These are useful our life. Issued by Snakes Club. Classroom task. Children now sit in groups and prepare the poster of your own interest and present it to the class with the help of your teacher. Children, we will meet you again in the next digital class that is editing process will be taken up in that particular class. I hope you will enjoy that session also. Bye.